Hey guys, Jeff here with Fat Kids Barbecue. Welcome back to another episode. Today, we're smoking bone-in chicken breast, but that's not all. We're whipping up a holy mole Mexican mole sauce. Really looking forward to this one. start out with our rub. We're making a nice Mexican rub. It calls for one and a half, you can't get that in there, teaspoons of oregano. So that's good. Then we're going to put uh, one teaspoon of onion powder. You think they would make these bottles a little bit wider. Now we're looking at three quarters of a teaspoon of Lori's seasoned salt. You can use any seasoned salt, I just called it that. So that's pretty good. Now we're looking at three quarters of a teaspoon of crushed red pepper flakes. That's pretty good. Half a teaspoon of garlic powder. I will put this recipe down below. And I have a feeling this is gonna be a good one. Half a teaspoon of chili powder. And then it calls for a third of a teaspoon to ground cumin, but I think we'll just go half. So that's good. We'll get these guys out of the way. We've got the trigger warming up outside, so we are going to smoke these breasts. We've got it warmed up at 225 degrees. And we're going to cook these until they reach an internal temperature of 165 degrees. Oh, is that going to be delicious. We are going to flip it over. Hit the back side of these guys. Usually when you make a chicken mole, you do it with a boneless breast. But I thought, why not try it with our friend friends here, the bone in. They look really good. So all right, we covered this pretty good. We're gonna get these guys out onto the Traeger. All right, guys, so our Traeger's warmed up to 225 degrees. We're gonna get these breasts right on. And man, is it cold and windy out here. We'll let the uh, Traeger do its thing. All right guys, so our chicken's finishing up out on the grill. I figured it was time to start our mole sauce. So we're gonna throw about a cup of onions in. We've got some uh, minced garlic. Now if you wanna peel garlic, if you wanna, um, put it through a garlic press, have at it. You know, I've told you that before. Now I will put the mole sauce recipe down below as well as our rub. 
our chicken's finishing up. I figure our chicken's probably got another 10 minutes or so. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna let this um, onion cook down a little bit. We want it to be translucent. <coughs> we're gonna make sure there's no big chunks because the last thing I wanna eat is a big chunk of onion. All right, so now what we do is we're going to add our chili powder. The recipe is calling for about a quarter of a cup. Now we're going to add some all-purpose flour. We're making a little bit of a roux here. Can't forget our cinnamon. Already that smells good. That's amazing. Boy, does that smell good already. Wow. The cinnamon. Mixed in with that chili powder. Unbelievable. So now we're going to add our um, the rest of our ingredients. We're going to add the cumin. We'll add the oregano. You know, I always tell you, if you haven't made something before, print a recipe. It's not that big of a deal. Now we have to mix this up until everything is evenly mixed. I guess that's pretty good. Now it wants us to add the vegetable stock. So we'll add our vegetable stock. All right, so now our recipe is calling for us to put this into a blender. So we broke out our Vitamix. And we're gonna dump this guy right in here. So that's pretty good. And it wants us to puree it. That's great, I'm so happy. I won't have to eat those onions all chopped up like that. Oh, that's gonna be fantastic. Look at that. That's great. So now it wants us to bring this thing up to high heat. So we'll get that puppy going. We're gonna add our sea salt. You don't want to too much sea salt. You don't want this to be too salty. We'll add our sea salt. Then we're going to add our 
cocoa powder. Our tomato paste. And now we're going to add our almond butter. So this is good. This is great. Oh, does that smell good. Wow. Is that amazing? That aroma is crazy. I'm gonna crank that temperature up. Let's give this a taste. Wow, is that delicious? So we're gonna let this render down a little bit and thicken up some. All right, guys, so our chicken got up to 165 degrees. Our mole sauce thickened up nicely. This stuff is looking beautiful. We did a really good job on that. Time to give this guy a try. Let's see what we think. We did make some yellow rice. We put the yellow rice down below. Oh my goodness, this chicken is beautiful. Oh my goodness, I could eat this with just the rub alone. That rub on here, unbelievable. Wow. The mole, my goodness, I gotta dip it in here. <clears throat> wow, does that look unbelievable? <clears throat> wow, that flavor, outrageous. That is amazing. If you like what you see guys, as much as I like this, click that like button down below, subscribe to the channel, who knows where we're going next week. Thanks guys. Time for dinner. Wow. Unbelievable.